Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel for Point University. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create trifold brochure design in PowerPoint. So let's start. Add a new slide, go to view tab, enable the guides, go to insert shapes, select rectangle. Ctrl D duplicate it. Make it no outline. Give some different color. Press Ctrl D one more time. So I've created three rectangles. Go to format background and give a different background color. Again press Ctrl D and make three more rectangles. And go to insert shapes, select circle, hollow circle and give a different color with no outline. Increase the size so that it will fit uh, in all the three rectangles and place it over here. So make sure that you have to spend a good amount of time in aligning this one. So select the three objects first select the circle and then the three rectangles go to merge shapes and say subtract or you can just say fragment you can see that that area has been fragmented and delete the rest I'm just giving a different color for this and you can delete the upper part as well and then you can add any picture particular in this uh, shape whatever the image you have select the image And then you can go and change the color. So change the color. You can use any color of your choice. It depends on your requirement. Go to insert again shapes and you can select the free form. Right. So you can remove the outline, right mouse click, go to edit points and then you can give it a curve shape. And give a different color for this. Go to insert shapes and select a rectangle.
and I'm giving a different color for this as well and say send to back press ctrl D and go to gradient fill I'm just giving two stops here you can use one black color and make the, the other is white select the white and make the transparency to hundred percent and this to somewhat maybe 50 60 percent yes so that it will give a, a trifold effect press ctrl d again adjust it press ctrl D and place it the other side first rotate it and place it this side and then you can add some text over here You can make it very loose and increase the font size and you can press ctrl D and you can reduce the size and you can add some more text here. and align it properly then you can go to insert shapes and you can just select some oval shape here make it no outline and you can give some different color for this as well press ctrl D and make it uh, three oval shapes there This is kind of a thing we are giving a, a text the points we are providing here You can add any subtitle here and some some detailed text for the subtitle make it a smaller font and bring it here select both the objects and align it and press ctrl D and bring it down this will be text 2 and this is a text 3 You can add some subtitles or the headings here.
add your company name and the black font is not visible there so you can just change the font to white or whatever here I'm just giving some a different shade for the circle press ctrl D and change the color maybe white go to shapes and again select a rectangle and I'm going to delete the the right side only by keeping the left side and then change some different color reduce the size and just say send to back yeah something like this if you want you can make one more I'm just grouping it and reducing the size and bring it, in, bring it in center so that's it from me friends hope you like this video and don't forget to subscribe my channel powerpoint university